All right, you millennials, worthless scrubs. Time for more tips from baby boomers. See, a guy like me, I was able to put myself through college working a single minimum wage job. All you kids crying, my boys got my intuition. Shut up. I'm about to drop some knowledge on you, darn kids. Starting off with, in this series, job hunting and getting a job and working a job. All you darn millennials crying, I got a flat burgers. Back in my day, that's how I paid for my college. I flipped burgers. Of course, minimum wage is actually level of wage back then, but <clears throat> anyways, all you kids, you know what you need to need to hit the streets and ground and pound. Go around, hand out your resumes to different companies. Huh? What? They, they tell you not to do that anymore? In fact, if you show up and doing that, they'll throw that resume in the garbage because they want it all online? Bah, it's not like anything's changed in the past 50 years since I went out and got a job. Ah, you darn kids, it's too damn lazy to go out there and meet and greet people. Oh, I got social anxiety. Back in my day, we didn't have no dang social anxiety. Hmm? Just because Mount Everest wasn't discovered by white people until like 1856 doesn't mean Mount Everest didn't exist? Sure it did. If white people don't know about it, it don't exist. Anyways, yes, all you darn kids acting like you're too good to flip burgers or you're too good to work a janitor or in the mailroom. Back in my day, that's how I said I set off in the mailroom. Then I got no. I moved up and banged a couple of CEO's wives, so they put in a good word for me. And that's how I got my job that I'm at today. God, just five more years and I get to retire. Yeehaw! It's going to be great getting to retire on my full pension and benefits and packages. Oh, it's going to be great. Hmm? Jobs don't offer that anymore for these kids? They want 22-year-olds with 10 years of experience just to get a, an unpaid internship? Ah, oh, you darn kids, you're just so damn lazy. Mm, yeah, you just got to go out there and put in the time and effort. Get out there, hand out your resumes, get out there, and beat up people so you can get the job instead of them. That's right, go into a store, break a kneecap, then play for the place. Hey, now you know they have an opening. Ah, oh, you darn kids are so damn lazy, refusing to work five full-time jobs while going to school full-time, while going 80 grand into student loan debt that you can't get rid of with bankruptcy, and has a 23% interest rate. Back in my day, we didn't need no dang student loans. Our parents paid for us to go to college. God, kids these days are so damn lazy not having their parents pay for everything. Back in my day, ah, we didn't have that issue. I could go out, I go out with my friends every weekend, go to toga parties, toga, toga, toga. Now these kids are like, all right, do I get six hours of sleep or do I study? No, oh, because I'm working five jobs and I'm going to school full time. I can either sleep or I can study. Uh, I guess I'll do two hours of sleep and four hours of study. Ah, oh, you darn kids are just damn lazy. Back in my day. Mm, those uh, kids are just lazy these days, darn millennials. That's why you gotta watch this series on baby boomers giving advice to kids, like on how to get a job. Again, ground and pound, hand out your resumes. Don't be using those newfangled computers to apply online like all the companies tell you to do. This is because a lot of places only have online resumes now and you can only apply online. Bah! It's not like anything's changed since my day 50 years ago. Kids are just lazy nowadays. Tura, eating your darn Tide Pods. Mm. Back in my day, we didn't do anything stupid like that. We just drove cars at each other and waited for someone to swerve. And if someone didn't swerve, well, then you crashed. But back in my day, we were tough. We could do that and just wreck a car and then go out and buy another one for 500 bucks. Brand new. Oh, you darn kids are just so spoiled nowadays. Crying that it costs three grand for a used car that will fall apart in six months. Just darn lazy kids. Go out and get another job. Get six jobs. Lazy millennials. God, I feel so bad for saying this stuff.